you know how they say you have to take care of yourself if you want to live healthy, live long, wow. all the all the right things. So today I'm here, I being James Bramie, out mm-hmm. of the Bujo, I am here with one of the best guys when it comes to fitness and lifestyle that I could think of interviewing for you and then sharing this gospel of well-being with you. Mm-hmm. I'm here with Michael. Michael, how are you doing? I'm fine, James. How are you? I'm great. Michael and I have known each other, give or take, um, 20 years. Mm-hmm. And... Um, it makes sense for me to come here and let him tell you about his brand regardless. So yeah. Michael, regardless. Yeah. What is regardless? So okay, regardless <laughs> my bad, sorry. Okay. Um regardless is a fitness company where we do everything um concerning fitness. So we started by producing merchandise, then we also decided to add fitness services to people because we feel like that's more important. Everything's about health. So we decided to provide fitness and um, well-being service to um, people and mostly the corporate people as well. People who can't really go to the gym because, I mean, stay in Accra, people close work very late and there's traffic. You get to the house, you can move to the gym and you don't even know who, which trainer to trust and all that. So we decided to solve all these kind of issues and just train people whether in their offices or in their house or wherever they feel very comfortable. So. Basically, that's what um, regardless is about everything fitness is like just like the name regardless. Nice, right. So, um, with regards to the merchandise, what what um, do you guys have to offer? Like, what do you sell? I know okay. you're in a very nice looking yeah. t-shirt. I saw yeah. you earlier with some cool shorts that match as well. Right, right, right. I don't want to show them my tie, so I had to go change. <laughs> anyway. We're not tempting you. No, 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 no. Yeah. So, um, yeah. So when it comes to the apparel, we had a lot of stuff. Um, so I was studying the fitness uh, brands in Ghana, and I realized most of the brands sell just um, yoga suits, top and down, just a few who sell t-shirts and shorts. So it felt like people who kind of like the plus size people were not getting um, their um, their Clothing. clothes, yeah, just to go to the gym. So we wanted to do everything for everyone. Um, for the the people who want to just like expose themselves, people who want to cover themselves and all that. So we have, I mean, variety. You have everything when it comes to shorts, t-shirts for women, like oversized one, the tank top, the loose ones, like everything. We just want to produce everything for them, and we've been able to, I mean, go through that for about two years now. So yeah, I think we're doing great. Nice, nice. Yeah. I'll, I'll definitely be copying some of your merchandise yeah. too. You guys get hoodies, right? Yeah, we have everything. Oh, perfect. Yeah. Tank top hoodies, um, full sleeve hoodies, like everything. Yeah. Guys, in the comment section, let me know if you like the blue show to work with regardless and get some merchandise out for you. Right. Yeah. And then with the with the fitness side, um, right. you mentioned you guys do um, um, services where you attend to people who can't necessarily move to the gym right. either because of yeah. their schedules and all that. Right. Um, how does how's the process like? How do people book you? Okay, so we people can book us through our website. We get some of them through calls, and I mean our personal ones also contact us. I mean, of uh, yeah, recommendations and other things. So um, that's how the, most of the bookings is done. But usually we have to assess your location and um, your schedules and other things also to finalize on um, what everything. And we provide all the fitness services from dance to yoga to swimming to sports coaching, aerobics, anything you can think of. We have, I mean, coaches to give you all these things. So you can get all these under just one package. So that's what we're trying to just give to, them, uh, give to the people. You don't have to just go get a yoga instructor, then get somebody else to come and um, what's name teach you swimming, then get somebody else to pay um, uh, to pay for aerobics. I mean, we're gonna give you all this and I just want package. So that's what regardless is all about. It's just one one call, everything you get all these kind of things. So you can, I mean, through our website, email, social media pages, anywhere you can just hit us up. Even if you know a friend of us, just talk to them. They'll come and talk to us. Anyhow, you get to. I mean, we are official, but not so official. You get it. We understand the process. You can be so busy. You don't necessarily have to go through and it's just be comfortable. Anyhow, you want to get to us, just get to us. We we'll just hear you out. So with regards to the social media, which um which platforms are you guys on? Um okay, so we are on um Instagram, Twitter, LinkedIn, um then um, YouTube. Um we're trying to start a YouTube um, channel, but we've not started yet. So but we still have the page, and all of them is regardless mood at regardless mood. Um, so yeah, for the socials, that's where we are. Definitely. Except Facebook, I think we have Facebook, but we are not very active. Yeah. I'll get you social media, man. Uh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay. I actually have somebody I'm training for that. Yeah. No, sorry. He's very active. He's one of what I am um, trainers as well. Saying I appreciate the work he's really doing. Like, so if you want, maybe I could bring him so you guys also train him because like 
he's not coming up. Yeah, he's very good. He's he likes to learn. So I yeah. say, you see how they are recommending you. <laughs> so yeah, regardless, has been in existence for two years. Yeah, two years. Two yeah. years, and then um, you you cover a whole lot and mm. stuff. How how would you um say you could probably help um mm. people who either want to boost their self esteem when it comes to fitness? All right. So um, with our coaches, we train them, right? And one of the things we train is behavior change and motivation. So um, you don't just come in. Some people are like, you don't want to do it. And it's like, okay, if you don't want to do it, there's nothing. We need to un- study your behavior and how we're going to motivate you. So it's one of the things we train our trainers with. So, I mean, we got all covered. And so, I mean, it's one of the least things to worry about. Yeah, too. However, just come. We'll train you. Right? It's regardless. That's mm-hmm. reassuring for me because I have an yeah. attitude problem when it comes to working out. Yeah. I have a treadmill that I don't actually use. I watch, yeah. but I don't use. Yeah. And yeah, it's something that I need to work on. So yeah. it's, it's reassuring for me to hear. I mean, a lot of people like you, though. People um, actually want to do it, um, but they don't get up and do it. Um, and I used to tell people it's not about how hungry you are. It's about wanting to do it because I've seen people who are hungry and there's food, but for them to get up and go and eat is an issue. I mean, starting motivation, like, nah, I mean, how hungry are you? It's not about how hungry you are. Yes, if he's hungry and doesn't want to eat, he doesn't want to eat. You need to find a way to convince them. It's like medicine. Medicine, if they don't want to take it, they know, just let them know they need to take it. Even if they don't want to, they'll still have to take it. You get it. It's not about how hungry you are. It's about just letting the person understand it. And it's a lot of ways you need to let certain people understand certain things. When there's a time you need to go hard on them, there's a time you need to convince them, there's a time you need to go soft, there's a time you need to reason with them. You get it. There's sometimes like you need to be like, I mean, boss up on them and just let them do it. A lot of times. So you need to study whoever you're working with um, and see how you, co- you, you work with them, like get the best out of them for them to achieve their own results. Yeah. That's right. That's right. So you, I know you've already mentioned the social media platforms right. you are on, but um, can you give us all the ways they can contact you? And do you guys are still working as well? Working. Um, okay, so it's a thing we've been working on. Um, one of our, um, my team members uh, said it last time that we should do working, but um, that's it's something we've not agreed yet. We're still discussing it. Um, uh, we are saying that the least we might do might be weekly because right now we do just monthly. That's a minimum um, subscription. Uh, but we're still thinking about it uh, because we don't want a case where people just come in one and just go. We It's not just about us getting the money. We can do the work and then we get money and we go. But we want you to achieve your results. And you know, it's a process, right? It's a working process. So um, with the whole fitness, we need to start something and I mean, go through a whole process which can take three to six months to achieve the results. And the results is like very important to us. You get it. So, with the whole working thing, um, it's, well, I, mean, I might li- want to listen to your working, I mean, situation. You can just still DM us. I mean, we we'll respond to our emails and other things. But working is not something we really do right now. So, yeah. He'll prefer coming to you guys. So, yeah. just be comfortable. Call. Yeah, that's so. He gets you what you need. And then right. you guys work out. So, basketball, that's right. another one of your yeah. loves. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. How, 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 is it, how is it like in the basketball scene from your perspective? What, right. what would you describe it as and how would you... Like, the basketball in Ghana. That basketball in Ghana. Yeah, um, basketball in Ghana, yeah. I mean, it's on the low, but yeah, it's on the low. And if you, like I said, uh, okay, sorry, I didn't, that's not going to come in, but it's on the low. So... If you keep going the same way, we might just, I mean, go that same way. It's like somebody trying to say, I'm going to jog all the way from Kumasi to Accra. I'm not saying you can't. It's a process. It, certain process takes a long time, but, I mean, if, you might keep longer on the road. It's going to take you days. Something you're supposed to use, for example, just some five hours on the bus to get it. You get it yeah. So, um, we need to step up. One, I mean, from the players to the organizers to the um, the the um, basketball bodies like I was I started the league in Kumasi before I and mean, we were doing tournaments and other things and I never met all the basketball uh, associates in Kumasi it took some time before I, I mean Mr Ed the basketball president um, called uh, we need to go and meet um, um, was it Ashanti regional basketball reps and all that and that was even after years and we didn't even know the people like that we don't know whether they are working or they are not working I mean across certain people are 
or like a, um, when you go to places, the same places you see, same, so same people you see, same faces, being players, being officials, like there's no recruitment, there's no room for new players to grow. But if you go to other courses, you see certain people and like you can see these people are very amazing, like they're playing very well. If you just give them some slight chance. Uh, you see one player, that player will go to Accra Poly, go and play all the three years, now go back to UCC, go and play another four years. You get to me, there's somebody in UCC who's in four, uh, first year who can actually use maybe first two years to grow mm -hmm. and also get a chance as well. But that same person have to play all the seven years, sit on other people's chances. I mean, if you keep doing that, I don't think the game is going to grow anyway. So. Mm -hmm. Well, let's, hope, let's hope for better and I'm sure yeah. Megales will have a very huge role to play with regards for real, to For real, for <laughs> real. Yeah, we have fans for that. That's right. Uh, That's right. So then wrapping up your social media handles again and then um, other contact details. Right. Yeah, um, so it's Regales Mode um, on Instagram, Twitter, um, YouTube and LinkedIn. Regales Mode and um, the website is regalesmode.com and our email is info at regalesmode.com then our uh, phone number is 0550-188-881. So, yeah, I don't know if there's something I left out. If he's left out something, there's a link to you that I'll add mm -hmm. as well, just in case. Very good. It links you to everywhere, brochure, website, everything. Uh, and it's so detailed. I mean, I, 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 love, I love the attention they put in you. Uh, thanks to Alexis. <laughs> Alexis made that for us. <laughs> yeah, there are a lot of names I'm supposed to mention, but I mean... Uh, I don't have all the time. <laughs> a lot of people behind this, uh, a whole lot of people, yeah, a lot. Yeah. See, the regardless vision is no small. Right. Mm -hmm. Michael, thank you yeah. for your time. Thanks. It's been a pleasure, and I'll okay. definitely be back here right. to come and do stuff. Uh, hopefully, you. yeah, hopefully yeah, we'll be we, bigger we, then. We'll yeah. talk more about the mission. Yeah, 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 sure. <laughs> all right. Put yours here, put mine in there. Oh, I mean, yeah, ready for that. <laughs> all right. So, guys, it's been a pleasure bringing this interview to you. My name, once again, is James Bremita of The Blue Show. You can find us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, YouTube, and on LinkedIn at The Blue Show or The Blue Show 3690. You can find me, James Bremita, on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and on LinkedIn. Bye.